Patrick Mahomes and his wife Brittany transformed an eight acre plot of land worth $400,000 into a grand estate fit for the ruler of the Kansas City Chiefs. Having inked a lucrative 10 year $450 million contract with the Chiefs in August 2020, Patrick invested a portion of his earnings to buy the land the very next month. Talking on Netflix's quarterback, Patrick shared, I actually decided to secure the land when I signed my contract here in Kansas City. I signed a 10 year extension because I knew I wanted to be here. So right when I did that, I thought I'm going to be here. I might as well construct the exact house I want. The sprawling estate completed around on February 2023 boasts a cutting edge home gym, an indoor basketball court, an expansive fish tank, a home theater, and naturally a trophy display. Football star Patrick Mahomes and Brittany Matthews, now Brittany Mahomes, share a love story that's as captivating as the quarterback's performances on the football field. Their journey from high school sweethearts to a power couple in the sports world is nothing short of heartwarming. The roots of their love story trace back to their hometown of White House, Texas, where Patrick and Brittany first crossed paths while attending White House High School. Their connection blossomed during their teen years, and it became clear that they were destined for something special. As Patrick's football career began to soar, Brittany remained a constant pillar of support. She not only celebrated his successes, but also stood by him during challenges and setbacks that come with pro sports. Their relationship endured the test of time and distance as Patrick pursued his football dreams. In September 2020, the couple reached a significant milestone when they announced their engagement. Patrick proposed to Brittany at the iconic Arrowhead Stadium, the home turf of the Kansas City Chiefs. Shortly after their engagement, Patrick Mahomes signed a historic 10-year, $450 million contract extension with the Kansas City Chiefs, solidifying his status as one of the highest paid athletes in the world. The couple's journey took an exciting turn as they embraced the opportunities that came with this success. Since having their first child in 2021, Patrick and Brittany are now proud parents of two. Beyond the glitz and glamour of the NFL, Patrick and Brittany have remained grounded, often sharing their family life on social media. From adorable family photos to celebrating milestones, they invite fans into their world, showing the love and laughter that define their family dynamic. When it comes to their home life, no doubt the young family lives in style too. Let's check out Patrick Mahomes' mansion. Patrick and Brittany Mahomes Homes transformed an eight acre parcel of land, originally valued at $400,000, into an opulent residence fit for royalty. Well, Kansas City Chief royalty, that is. In August 2020, Patrick scored his huge contract with the Chiefs, and the following month he used a portion of those earnings to secure the land. Reflecting on this choice in an episode of Netflix's Quarterback, the NFL star explained, I actually decided to acquire the land when I signed my contract here in Kansas City. I signed a 10 year extension because I knew I wanted to be here. So right when I did that, I thought I'm gonna be here, I might as well build the exact house I want. That he did. The home finally completed around February 2023 after three years of construction boasts features like a state-of-the-art home gym, an indoor basketball court, an expansive fish tank, a home theater, and a trophy case. The massive fish tank is situated in their living room, while their sleek, contemporary kitchen features black cabinets, a white and gray marble island, chrome hardware, and modern appliances. While the exact square footage of the mansion remains unknown, aerial views show plenty of space for their family of for and guests, including celebrity BFFs like Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey. Beyond the interior, the couple added a sprawling pool, hot tub, private pond, a par three golf hole, and a 50 yard football field with the Mahomes logo at the center and their last name spelled out on the end zone. Patrick's an avid golfer in his spare time, so he loves the three par on the grounds of their home. On the docuseries, Brittany expressed the excitement, saying, finally, we're gonna have a home that we built and is everything we could ever dream of having. While the couple shared a glimpse of the unfinished home on Netflix's quarterback, they've been discreet about showing their lavish estate online. However, their Cass County mega mansion isn't their only remarkable property. The couple has already crafted an impressive real estate portfolio, having recently sold properties like their first Kansas City condo for about $550. $50,000. In January 2019, they invested $1.8 million in a three-bed, four-bath mansion
kitchen, extensively renovating it. This contemporary ranch features a chef's kitchen, a 500 bottle wine room, a home gym, a shoe room, a pool, hot tub, and more. The Mahomes family also acquired a four bed, seven bath mansion in their home state of Texas for $3.37 million in March, 2020. Since Patrick's entry into the NFL in 2017, they've purchased four homes and sold two. Before the completion of this current dream home, the couple spent off seasons at a 7,800 square foot manor described as the entertainer's dream. This contemporary marvel had soaring ceilings, a floating staircase, wet bar, and convenient access to a golf course. In 2019, Patrick was celebrating a milestone when he and his wife, Brittany, purchased their first real home for the price tag of just over $1.9 million. Chief fans hoped that this Kansas City home purchase signified a long stay on the team for Patrick. Turns out they were more than right. This home that they lived in before is set beside the Mission Hills Country Club and described as a remarkable contemporary ranch on estate-sized grounds spanning about 1.4 acres. Interiors span over 4,300 square feet with three bedrooms, including an impressive master room fit for a king, as well as other features like a private swimming pool and a huge wine cellar. The couple's home here was built back in 1953 and boasts the clean lines and connection to nature that many of the best homes from that era are known for. While they kept a lot of the original features of the home, the couple renovated much of the place to modernize it and to fit their tastes. Our home is amazing. Um, it's everything we ever wanted. For the look of this home's interiors, the couple chose a lot of dark woods, fireplaces, white walls, and gray furniture accents. There's a versatile floor plan in the house with expansive rooms, tall ceilings, and ample windows. There are multiple living areas, most with fireplaces and glass doors to the yard outside. Both the large formal dining room and the kitchen offer floor to ceiling windows, and the chef's kitchen has Eden bars seating, stainless steel appliances, and opens to the family room. Other highlights include a full bar in one of the common rooms, an office, and a wine cellar. Patrick and Brittany's master suite here is approximately 1,250 square feet and is made up of a large bedroom, walk-in closet with built-ins, their own laundry room, spacious ensuite bath, and an attached home fitness center. The property offers a terraced lawn with a swimming pool, new hot tub, large patios, rose garden, and extensive landscaping. There's also a gorgeous screened porch or sunroom overlooking the backyard. One other design request Patrick had for this home was a proper place to display his impressive sneaker collection. Enter his shoe room. Room, I feel like you lose the value of some of your shoes. Some of the shoes that you've worn once you forget about because you don't see them. So I wanted that shoe room to highlight that. Patrick stated, I literally wanted this a shoe room my whole life, so this is big for me. Now, I can only think that in his new dream home, he built an even bigger shoe room. Finally, Patrick was said to have purchased a stunning modern mansion in Texas in 2020 for $3.37 million. It's said that the Mahomes family lives in this home during the off season, which is located in the upscale community of Westlake, Texas, and newly built in 2014. The home spans over 7,800 square feet of contemporary living space inside, along with four bedrooms and seven baths. The quarterback was actually born and raised in Texas and played both football and baseball at Texas Tech University. This stunning abode was described as an entertainer's dream with its sprawling and open layouts, while there are also views of the Vaquero Golf Course from all over. The impressive kitchen here has two large islands with marble counters and a breakfast nook as well as seating for 12 people, while the double high great room or family room comes equipped with a gas fireplace and leads outside via patio doors. The master suite boasts a spa bath with infinity edge tub, walk-in shower, and a separate dressing area, while there's also panoramic views from everywhere you look. Outside, there's an outdoor grill, a swimming pool and spa, a fire pit, and plenty of patio space to dine or lounge. While that's gonna wrap up our Patrick and Brittany Mahomes house tour, we got quite a good look at their custom dream mansion in Missouri, as well as some of their other gorgeous properties. Before we go, answer this question for me. What features would you most want if you were able to build your dream custom mansion? Let me know down in the comments. 
don't forget to hit subscribe and turn on your notifications so you never miss a video. I'm Kara, follow me on Instagram to chat and I'll see you all another time. Bye. Hey everyone, it's Kara or Kara the Vampire Slayer as you might know me and given my love for all things house and home, I recently wanted to get more hands on myself and I started tackling DIY projects at my own house. Being a new homeowner, there are plenty of unexpected things to fix and it's cool to learn what you're doing and hopefully be able to fix it yourself. There are also plenty of DIY projects suitable for beginners like me to do and ones that improve the look of your space drastically. Follow me and I'll teach you what I'm learning and motivate you to join me. You can DIY on a budget even if you're a total beginner. Follow me on Fix It With Kara and we can chat.